Yo, 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 what is good? It is your boy, DJ Mateo, your friendly neighborhood mutt mogul, coming to you live from Mogul HQ, aka the Mudhead TV, Emporium, full of gadgets and wizardries and everything mutt related. So, I'd like to bring you guys episode 3, episode 3 of the Becoming a Mutt Millionaire series, and this week, we are going to talk about packs being smart about packs so we all know the packs are the cornerstone of madden ultimate team uh there's two types of people out there people who loved love love packs we call them packaholics pack addicts you know and then we also have those guys who absolutely hate packs now i am not on the fence about either one because if i like a pack i'm gonna open it if it's uh not uh you know a good pack i'm not gonna open it so hands down that's how that goes um Packs, we all know, packs are basically like a lottery. You know what I'm saying? Everybody can't win a lottery, so everybody can't get good pulls out of packs. So what you'll see most of the time is people saying, oh, you know, EA, I ripped uh, 1,800,000 packs and I didn't pull a thing. You know, insert rage tweet here. I would show you a bunch of rage tweets, but I'm not going to. I was looking through some of them, and a lot of them, well, 89% of them were all vulgar and talked about how bad, you know, it was. So I'm not going to show those. But I'm just here to tell you, your packs, your pulling pro packs suck. You know, I'm not going to discourage you from doing it because there have been some, you know, lucky pulls on some rare occasions when people have pulled good things out of pro packs. But what I would suggest is you wait till the promo packs come out. That would be your legendary packs, your all Madden packs, my favorite, your game changer packs. That's when you are going to get the most bang for your buck. Um, let's see, if you are going to spend the money oh let's let's go back to one thing you know a lot of people seem to have this misconception you know about my series about you know how to become a month millionaire i don't have a million coins uh, this is true but if you look at my team my team is well oh worth over 2.2 mil now you know would i just sell off my team and show you a whole bunch of coins absolutely not why do that i play the game uh and also people seem to have a misconception to think that for some reason you're not supposed to spend money on the game yes if you look at my balance at the moment yes you see 74k and you see i have 6100 points i'm saving my points for some epic packs i'm just waiting on those to come out and then we're going to jump into it which brings me to my next point if you are going to spend money spend it at the right time right now there are no you know promo packs up right now so therefore i have 6100 points i'm not going to use them to open up pro packs uh i'm not going to use them to open up bundles or you know pro bundles or anything like that if you are oh look at that if you are going to you know use your coins to buy packs just buy the single packs you know that's you know you can get a return on your investment if you try chances are you probably won't um but <laughs> that is what i would advise you to do uh, and also just know packs are when you open packs packs are, you know thing content inside of packs are, you know determine when the packs are open not when the packs are bought so if you bought your game changer packs when they were coming out and then you wait for your team of the week cards for the next week you know chances are you'll get a good team of the week card inside those bundles so what i'm going to go ahead and do now while i have the time i'm going to open up five pro packs with my 75k and see what we get i'm gonna just do singles with the coins just so we can see how uh you know awesome these packs can be so look at that we got a bronze bronze let's see what we got ahead total bunch of bronze drake evans on the silver look at that we got a nice, nice little rttp card all right sorry i had to cut that pack short because i was ever so rudely interrupted by my significant other uh so let's go through all that yep that's that pack and now we're gonna go to the next one all right so far we haven't really got anything pack number two we have 15,000 uh, coins. So we got Jets home, another silver. We'll have to check that. Whoa, well, I'll be John Brown. We definitely pulled red paint on the second elite pull. I mean, uh, second pro pack pull. All right, so I, I'll say right there, I probably got my coins back. I should probably stop while I'm ahead, but you know what? I'm going to keep it moving. You know what? We should probably go stop at three because I don't trust going five, so we'll stop at three. Uh, 7, 14, 21. Let's see. We got a silver. I can't see what his name is because my big head's in the way. Uh, Chiefs D. Keem Spence. Jim Harbaugh. Panthers away. 
All right, we got a Brandon Tate. That's actually a nice wide receiver. And then Capron Lewis Moore. So out of the three packs that we pulled, we did get an elite card. I can't say that's going to happen often, but hey, it's like a lottery pull. That's what we just told you, you know? Don't expect big things each time, but I got lucky for the sake of this video. Go figure. Who would have thunk it? But surely not me. All right, so uh, like I said, the tips that we got, hey, don't spend coins on packs unless you buy buying, uh, you know, singles. Or if you just have that many coins you can spend, go ahead and do it. Uh, if you're going to spend money, make sure you do it at the right time. That's at the promos. When the promos start, you can be smart about that. If you buy a bundle, you could open up half the bundle, you know, when the promo drops with the new content, and then you can open the other half when new content drops. That's called Smart Pack Puller. Uh, like I said, if you're going to spend money, do it at the right time. And then the pack content is determined when the packs are opened, not when they are purchased. So if you have, you know, Game changer packs and you wait till the Christmas promo. Light bulb. Uh -huh. You know, you should probably maximize a lot of your profit that way. And make sure you just, yo, spend everything. Not spend, but uh, make sure you sell everything. If you pull something good at the start of that promo, you make sure you sell it immediately because that's when it's going to sell for the most. So, uh, usually I end these things with a nice little saying, but today I'll end it with a nice little quote. Uh, wise man named Confucius once said, never give a sword to a man who can't dance. That's it. Peace. I love you, but your boy gots to go.